This video demonstrates the working of the mechanical components of a brain machine interface we have constructed. Neural data for our experiment has been recorded from intracortical electrodes implanted in a monkey. The monkey executes a standard left right instructed delay center out reach task. Signal recording, conditioning and spike sorting has been carried out at the National Brain Research Center at Manesar. Only offline spike data has been used for analysis and experimentation. Our experimental plan is essentially this. The experiment begins with the automatic raisin dispensing mechanism, dispensing a raisin to one of the left or right target positions in a random fashion. During real time experimentation, this would be the target onset point. Since we are working only with offline data, at this point, a pre-recorded left or right signal is sent to the decoding program. A population vector based decoding algorithm which has been implemented by us tells whether the selected signal corresponds to left or right hand movement. This decoded data is then sent to the delta robot controller which executes a corresponding left or right motion. We will now show in detail how the setup works. The experiment begins with filling up the slots of the indexing disk with grams. Once a particular trial begins and a left or right direction is randomly chosen, the separating mechanism aligns with the corresponding hole. The indexing disk rotates by one slot dispensing one gram. The gram rolls down and lands on the corresponding target position. At this point, based on the random number chosen earlier, a left or right brain signal is selected and decoded using the population vector algorithm. Decoded control signal is then sent to the delta robot controller. Once the end effector reaches the target position, it picks up the gram and delivers it to the location where the monkey would be during the real-time experimentation. This completes one trial. 